Good morning, everyone. So today we are going to dissect uh, the labio rohita, and uh, we are dissecting it to get the Weberian ossicles. So before uh, starting our dissection process, let us know few uh, points about labio rohita. So it belongs to the kingdom Animalia and phylum Chordata, class Actinopterygii, order Cypriniformes, family Cyprinidae. and the genus is labio and species is rohita so if we see the external characters of uh, labio rohita so it is divisible into uh, three body parts so head region trunk region and tail region it is and uh, we can see it is covered with uh, scales all over the body and these are cycloid type of scales and if you see here these are the fins so this fin is a dorsal fin if you uh, see the shape of a fish it is a spindle shaped body it is a dorsal fin and here you have the pectoral fin a pair of pectoral fins here a pair of pectoral fins a pair of pelvic fins you have a single anal fin here and these are the caudal fins and if you see clearly here you find a dotted line structure which we call a lateral line and coming to the color of the body it is uh, grayish black in color towards the dorsal side but gradually the body color will be lighten as we move to the ventral side so it is like a silvery whitish color towards its ventral side so here we are talking about the dissection of weberian ossicles so weberian apparatus uh, here we can find the weberian apparatus at the uh, swim bladder or it is a air bladder this weberian apparatus are connected to the um, air bladder towards the auditory system so it is an anatomical structure that connects the swim bladder uh, and uh, this majorly consisting of four pairs of bones specially it is it serves to enhance the hearing by conducting pressure and changes uh, pressure changes produced by externally originating sound waves from the sw swim bladder so we can say that this weberian apparatus act as an amplifier for the fish so uh, let us see in detail so here i am going to uh, section the fish in this region we find the air bladder so here we have uh, taken the section of this part and uh, see here you can find a white color part this is called the air bladder so let us go into the deeper sections of this region so before going to that we can uh, clean off this the waste part in this region so we can clear off this and we should move on to the deeper layers of this part you hmm. see so this is the air bladder as we have already discussed that the weberian ossicles will be connected to the uh, swim bladder to the auditory system so somewhere we can find in between this so yes so so here we found the weberian ossicles and next we have to mount it yes so this is our uh, dissection and here we can see the weberian ossicles so let me explain you the different parts of this weberian ossicle in detail see here we can find the articulating process this one is the articulating process and you can see the projections here the processes so this end is known as transformator process and this is uh, the claustrum the edge is the claustrum and here it is a scapium so this with this the entire body we called as tripus so this the mid mid region is called the body of tripus and this end we call the posterior ramus and here it is the 
anterior ramus as we have discussed this the major part here it is the articulating processes so this is all about the weberian ossicles the different parts of it thank you